well, these proteins control what chemical information comes into the cell and what chemical information goes back outward. And we've had very limited understanding of how these proteins work, but with this new technology of cryo-EM, we can readily uh, isolate these um, what we call membrane proteins and, and study their three-dimensional structure. And so my laboratory specializes in um, characterizing the structure and function of this class of proteins that sit within our membrane and control the, the flux of chemical information. And so to study it, we, we get uh, eyes um, from model organisms, um, like uh, sheep or cow, and we isolate the protein. Um, we put it in the microscope and we determine the structure uh, uh, with atomic resolution. To understand, again, how this protein facilitates uh, the circulation system in the eye lens. And so it was impactful because we learned not only about how this protein may contribute to cataracts, for example, through these mutations, but this family of membrane protein is, is expressed throughout our bodies. The impact of this goes kind of beyond the lens into understanding how these, this family of channels transports both chemical and electrical information between cells and across organs.